Welcome back to STL Live. I'm Raina Ray here with Carrie Goldwasser, Director of Marketing and Sales for Two Hill Performing Arts Center. I know that's your job, but it's almost like you don't have to do any, you really don't have to sell anything. It kind of sells itself. It's so, I mean, listen, when I tell people that um, Brad Sherwood and Colin Mookery from Whose Line Is It Anyway are coming to the Two Hill and they're going to be on stage with mouse traps and the guys are going to be blindfolded and they have to walk toward each other, I mean, it's hilarious. What, <laughs> what else do I need to tell you? It's so funny. We're looking forward to um, their show. It's called Colin and Brad Two Man Group. Hilarious. Not I, blue, two. Two. Two man group. <laughs> so funny. Um, but, you know, then we also and have some, um, <laughs> I mean, it's hilarious. Um, and then um, in October, we have a performance by an, a group called Classic Albums Live. Mm -hmm. And what they do is they take performance of um, classic rock slash pop albums and recreate them with the same um, respect that an orchestra would for a Mozart performance, for example. So they build this group every time for the specific um, album that they're going to perform. So when they're at the Two Hill, they, um, this October, they'll perform um, Pink Floyd's Dark Side of the Moon, note for note, it's not a gimmick, it's not a cover band, wow. it is note for note. Wow, now that's amazing. Yes, and I've heard them and they're wonderful. We just missed the quart. I think the quartet was just on the screen and we missed them, but we'll come back to the quartet. Who's it? Gregory Porter is an up and coming jazz singer and if you haven't heard his voice, he is incredible. My, I believe my 13 year old daughter said, that's the sound that I want to sing me to sleep every night. Wow. It's just his, he is, he just won a, uh, yes, a Grammy for best jazz vocal. And we are working with Jazz St. Louis to present him this um, February, I believe. He's coming in February. Wow. Well, you brought some other pictures of the, um, the quartet, I think, was up there a minute ago. When they put the quartet up, I want you to talk about the quartet because they're pretty special. The Ariana String Quartet are. is our professional um, quartet in residence. And their season opener is September 11th. And it, the concert is called Essential Ariana. And this group is known worldwide. Um, they just happen to be in our backyard and call the Two Hill home. Um, they have a recording contract. They record all of their albums um, at the Two Hill. And they are incredibly gifted professional musicians, also wonderful personalities. And they stay after the show um, at a reception and speak with anybody who wants to come up and talk to them afterwards and ask them about what they just heard. Wow. I think we have a list of your upcoming events. If they yes. put it up on the screen for us, we can talk about that. But, you know, ticket prices aren't bad over there either. You would think that you would pay more for the amazing entertainment that you get at Two Hill. We really work very hard to be affordable. Um, and so for something like, you know, a living legend like the Stanley Clark Band, Stanley Clark is, you know, he's He's revolutionized bass playing, and um, we just, you know, for him to be there on November um, 21st and to have affordable ticket prices, it just makes, it just is very important to those of us who are there at the facility working to bring people in and make sure that everybody has access to see these performances, even if they maybe, you know, don't have all the money in the world. Sure. Easy access to the great location just right off the highway, not yes. too hard to find. Yes, very easy. Um, and like I said, there were, there's a Metrolink that lets you off steps from the front door. So we are completely accessible, not only in terms of um, getting there, but also in terms of ticket price. Well, I am so glad that you came and shared this information with us today. I certainly hope our listeners do come out and check out some of the fantastic events coming up at the Two Hill Performing Arts Center. For ticket information on the events we cover today, as well as other upcoming performances, please visit twohill.org. There's more STL Live after this. Stay with us.